in this tutorial we are going to create a 3d window so let's start so I am already in 3d modeling workspace here so I will first click on view and select south east isometric then I want to create a vertical window so I will go to view and select a UCS of right so that I can work on right plane then I will come back to home and select rectangle give first point just right click take dimension option and give the le uh, length suppose I want to create a window of 1500 by 1000 so I will take 1500 as length and 1000 as width click the point so this bond outside boundary is ready so I will just keep a copy of this rectangle for making the frames afterwards so I want to create uh, develop this now so just offset give O give the distance of 50 and offset this rectangle inside so in inside frame will be ready then take the line command from the mid of this point go down to the mid of opposite point so this internal line is ready then just offset this line by 50 on either sides just say offset give the 50 give the point select the object give the point on other either sides ok enter then I want to extend this internal line on both up to both edges so just say extend select the boundary and click on the internal line so it will be extended up to the outside line then I don't want this internal line just trim them select the trim give the cutting edges press enter and click, the, click on the object to be removed so in this way two different frames are ready then internal structure I have to make so again take line then draw it from the mid of this point this line vertical line to the mid of this line opposite vertical line then same way you crea uh, create one vertical line from mid of this to the mid of bottom line just undo ok mid of bottom line ok escape then offset this line either side by 25 distance so we will create a frame uh, above 25 below 25 again vertical line on right side 25 on left side 25 so in this way now then erase the internal lines I don't want those lines reference lines so I will just erase those internal lines this vertical line I don't want just enter then trim the internal structure just remove these lines ok so this structure is ready then just copy this structure or just ok we will just trim the upper lines also trim this portion this portion then this bottom portion and this portion so just trim those lines so structure will be well connected so I don't want all these lines escape to come out trim trim bottom lines ok so this structure is ready now same structure I will be needing on this side also or one thing I will do I will just press pull it and copy that complete structure there so just press pull take your cursor inside the frame so it need to ca catch all the points ok give the length of 50 enter so it has not uh, broken this so we can remove that by press pull again give press pull and take this uh, rectangles squares and give the point on the other side press pull again 
then go inside the shape click go backward and click so this structure is ready then we need to apply glass to it for a gla application of glass just take the rectangle command then click on the mid of this horizontal line and move up to the mid of opposite line so I will just orbit so that I can view the upper points so I will zoom on this structure and I will just orbit it again so that I can view the bottom line ok so I will go to the mid of this line and this rectangle is ready now so I will come back to southeast isometry now zoom near and convert this rectangle to region so you can apply the material for making it to region just say draw click on draw region and click the rectangle that we drawn just now and press enter so this internal region is created now just apply the material so here already window wood material is there just click on that and select all right overhead the material select the outside frame so this wood is applied that for internal I want a mirror glass so just take this glass mirror overhead the material and take the internal structure so in this way this glass is ready now same uh, window I want on this side also just copy this window with glass and window structure and just take this end point as a base point upper point and put it on the other corner ok so in this way two opposite mirrors are ready uh, opposite windows are ready then I want to create a outside frame so th for that I keep this rectangle so I will just create a rectangle uh, square of 50 by 50 or suppose 75 by 75 just give the first point right click then give dimension of 75 by 75 so this rectangle is ready just sweep this rectangle for that you just go to this extrude click on the arrow just say sweep then select the rectangle that we just created ok that was not created I think so just say rectangle give the start point then just right click dimensions give 75 by 75 give the direction ok after that sweep then select the rectangle that we just created then just enter then right click so we want the end point to be on this so base point should be the end point of the rectangle so with respect to it, uh, end point it should be swept so we will take that end point and just click on the this rectangle so this frame is ready apply wood to this also overwrite the material and click on this so wood is applied to this also now this I want to put around the window just move it move take the midpoint of this internal line ok then put it on the mid of this bottom corner of the window just make ortho ok ortho is already off so I will just take the mid of this line so it is saying just zoom it again go closer and take the mid so in this way this frame is fitted around the window so in this way you can create a window in AutoCAD so thanks for joining we will stop here